Twelve years ago, I went on a trip to New York with a friend. A trip that I had no idea was going to change my life forever because I fell madly in love in just three days. Preparing for this day made me realize it wasn't just three days. This relationship developed organically since we were kids. I vow to love you endlessly until our last days. I promise to fight your challenges as fiercely as my own and celebrate your triumphs. I promise to always be your best friend and your biggest cheerleader. I promise to continue being your secret admirer. It's impossible for me to not have a crush on you every single day that I wake up. I promise you my heart, Chelsea, something of mine that you've had ever since we were kids, forever and always. We all know that I can't do anything on this earth without asking a million questions first. But if there are three things I've never questioned ever, ever in, in my, my entire, entire life, life, it's the love I have for you, the love you have for me, and whether I've always wanted to be right here right now someday. You are the light of my world, my soulmate, and it's really unbelievable that I get the chance to promise myself to the person I consider my greatest friend. Today, I finally stand here as your bride. As the woman who will become your wife. And as the woman who found the one my soul loves. So with this, I promise to continue to grow with you, to learn from you, to trust you, to always keep our lines of communication open, my mind open, and my heart open. And when we choose to start a family, I promise to be a loving and nurturing mother because together we'll continue to build a house and a home and a life filled with love, compassion, creativity, and empathy. I promise to love you every single day. I know a love as deep as ours is real, and I can't wait to love you endlessly for the rest of my life, because even forever would never be enough. And I can't wait to finally call you my husband. That's good. I don't know how I did that. The thing about Danny and Chelsea, why I think it's going to work for them is because there's a mutuality that runs through their whole relationship. They both, are, neither one of them is a finished product and they know it. Neither one of them is egotistical. They both share the same values when it comes to family. They laugh, but most importantly, they want to make each other happy. So on that note, to salud! To salud! Ladies and gentlemen, you have witnessed and seen Chelsea and Dan declare their love before you to all gathered here. They have made very special promises to each other and also to you all. So it is with these in mind and by the authority given to me by the Universal Life Church, the State of New York, and the Internet, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride.